Uh, siku nyingine tena kama kawaida mi nasema Mungu ameifanya na tumekutana hapa mara nyingine kufanya vile tuna tumezoea na leo tuna rafiki yangu mzuri 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 sana long time ago tulionana like uh, 2017 2018 hapo na leo tu nataka tuongee mambo ya eh, ya huduma 1 2 3 tujue leo hii amefikia wapi karibuni sana anaitwa Asia Joki hebu tuambie jina vizuri Asia Joki Asia Joki mimi ni mtaji wenyewe mimi ni mtaji wenyewe mtaji wenyewe Asia Okay pole Asia Joki Joki Okay tuambie tuambie umekuwa ah nimekuwa ni Nairobi mara mtu kuona mimi ni kuona kwa mama Maina ya kabisa kabisa tukifanya was it a lounge lao tumefanya vitu vingi kwa leo tumefanya vitu vingi kesha Sunday service yeah tumefanya vitu vingi sana huko na Mungu wake ndio yake mali kwa mapokeo na ukaenda tu pa ah corona happened makanisa zimetoza zikafungwa sehemu za ku za ku fellowship and watu wengi pia walipoteana but now we are back fully na kumbuka alikuwa anakupenda ulikuwa na imba hivi live anasema yule dada arudi aimbe tena alikuwa ananipenda sana huyo mama huyo mama hata ningemwambia sina fair akonda kanisa akinitumia aniambia nikuje kanisani yeah eh tuongelee about umesema mambo ya ya covid tunajua watu wa entertainment wasanii wale watu wanafanya vitu ambazo lazima watu wakutane pamoja tulikuwa affected sana sana sijisaidia hapo kulikuwaje ninaona pia umenyamaza sana what happened mi nilinyamaza even before covid so sita jitetea ni corona uh, i took like a f- four years break in music ministry nimerudi last year july uh, na nilirudi vizuri sasa mimi nilirudi vibaya okay hata for me eh, mimi nilipotea na nilikuwa na sababu zangu labda tuombe sababu zako za kuwe kupotea na, na kurudi pia uh, sababu zangu za kupotea he he in Nairobi ma producer wa he wa <laughs> mimi nilifanya audio mm-hmm. i had done two songs mm-hmm. so when i was planning not to release my third song mm-hmm. hey, producer kaamua to shoot niende minus ya kulipa venue ya kulipa makeup ya kulipa nini and by the end of the day hakunipa hiyo kazi mpaka leo hii sijawahi iona so you can infunja moyo a lot a lot a lot a lot then also challenges is a life mm. we face a lot of challenges mm. that made me keep dogo nika backslide sio vile watu wanasema ati eh, vile wasanii tumeona wasanii wengi wa kike na wa kiume wame change from gospel to secular so eh, most of the time msikia watu wakisema ukiona msanii wa gospel na nyamaza anakuja na secular na nimeona wewe umenyamaza and then umekuja na vitu kubwa mpa na wasanii wakubwa mpa paka wale wame wale wametimiza tu ndoto zao kwa gospel inakuwa kwaje uh, for me i think zile vitu nili go through in between those four years mm. zile ni drama closer to god mm. nilikuja ku realize that as much as na battle vitu mingi sana mahali tu naweza ikemea peke yake ni kwa mungu na huyo tu ndo akuniacha You know the people that will come expect what are happen na wewe I felt rejection the rejection ni kaniingiza into depression nikaanza kuchukia life yangu nikaanza kuchukia kila kitu but by the end of the day nilikuja ku realize God peke yake ndio atabaki na mimi This happened uh there's a song that nimer release few days ago it was the first song yenye it was my plan of a comeback but God had a better plan Hiyo song ni record July it is ukisikiza the song it is all about wale watu walikuwa karibu na mimi walinikata lakini wewe ni sikuli baki rafiki yangu peke yake nilikuwa najifungia kwa room yangu kwa bedroom sitoki ndatoka tu kwa room niende kitchen niangalie msichana kazi amepika nini nichukue ni kule nirudi kwa hiyo room nilikuwa nimejichukia nilikuwa na jiona mimi si mrembo nilikuwa na jiona mimi ni nothing you know i tried even committing suicide two three times and my elder cousin sister is a witness to this and the time nili feel nataka ku, ku, ku just serve god i just want to serve god i don't want to do anything else yani mimi mungu nichukue tu maisha yangu wacha life yangu iko all about you nikaona guardian ame post akona studio mimi nikao inbox the necessary 
manager the person that me and kwapo the manager in inbox nikafuatilia nikafuatilia nikaenda studio nika record his song nime release sunday and through that song that is how i got connection to guardian so mimi plan yangu ilikuwa ni release hii song mwema in july august but god alikuwa na plan your comeback itakuwa a collab with guardian Aisha mimi na kuelewa na kuelewa vizuri kwa sababu most of the time kwa channel yangu ama kwa eh, kwa Toti Talks huwa juzi nimekuwa na Haron eh unajua mm-hmm. Haron yeah, yule yule kijana wa Jalango mm-hmm. tuka nikaambia wase eh, about my channel eh, tu nimekuwa nikiongelea vitu vingi kwa sababu watu wamekuwa pia wakinikejeli mm-hmm. eh, tunaongea about eh, why why tunapenda ku mm-hmm. God na watu me stick mm-hmm. tunataka tu tuhudumie Mungu mm-hmm. licha ya mambo yote mm-hmm. Na nikakuwa naambia watu mm. unaweza fananisha watu na watu unaweza mm. fananisha wanyama na watu ama watu na kila kitu mm. lakini Mungu huwezi kufananisha na jambo lolote na one thing nimekuja to realize anybody anyone can let a kwa channel yangu anaongelea same thing zile nilianza nazo nikiongea mm. so mimi nafurahia mtu kama mimi nafurahia ile kitu nimeongea na tunakutana na mtu anjapanga anaongelea same thing ile kitu nimesema ndio ile kitu mimi nimepitia na that's why nimesema nitakuja nje mm. niseme kwa vivyoote watukane waseme mm. nini lakini Mungu anabaki kuwa Mungu Mungu anabaki kuwa Mungu so eh, ni mwana ngoma yako na kadi ya ninjo ya kwanza mm. na pia hii ngoma ya pili mm. nimeisikiza umeleza on sunday yeah? yeah. nimeisikiza mara mbili mm. kwa kwa nyumba na nikiwa tao mm. ngoma ambayo nilikuza sana mwenda kwa channel ya Asian Juki by them subscribe mm. share comment mpeni love manzee tuendelee na hii huduma mbele so tuambie about Cardian ka- Angel Cardian Angel ni mtu ambaye amekaa kwa kwa huduma bila alianza hadi sasa hivi mm. tu tuelezee about ye kidogo tu tujue Cardian ni nani uh, ni the ile kidogo naweza sema kuhusu Cardian Cardian ni mtu very supportive ha, 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 hana 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 sijui niite uselem ama niite usta he's very real kule guardian munaona hapa nje is the same guardian utamuona kwa studio utamuona kwa barabara yani he is the same person you will never feel the difference of him i've never seen fakeness in him together with his wife sijawahi ona fakeness in them and, and 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 guardian was like sent to god to me hiyo time niki meet guardian you know he, he he can he can he can even say it ama his manager can say it ama producer alexis can say it kuna sana naenda ka studio tunaenda ku record na shindwa kuimba naanza kulia wote wananiuliza unalia na sina kitu ya ku explain what i'm crying about but it's the love that i feel these people give me you know music music is not just easier to naenda ka studio na fungua mdomo unaanza kuimba there's a lot that comes we spend over six hours or even more yeah. just doing one song na kuna sasa inafikaga mahali wananiambia Asia sasa tunataka ufanye hard lips na wauliza okay hard lips ni nini ngojeni kwanza <laughs> wananielezea akishanielezea inatoka kwa akili yangu yeah. but huyu mtu hachoki bado anabaki kuwa supportive mm-hmm. bado ananiambia tu Asia Nime, nimekwambia nataka tufanye hard lips hard lips ni song ikiendelea unasema words in between kidogo ananiambia Asia i want you to do a higher note ongeza harmonies na mwambia mimi nimeshindwa siwezi nimefika mwisho if it was another celebrity i would be working with angekuwa anasema ah huyu acha tu hizi nyimbo zake tu zitoke because you know studio ni yake so yeah yeah ako there either to make money and produce talents and you know people who are ready to do music industry to, be, to do the music ministry and serve god but one thing i know about guardian miss dania kopale to make money in your studio yeah. as much as he's, he, he's making money in it but he helps us wale wasani wote umeona wa record seven heaven you will feel touch ya guardian kwa nyimbo zao acha ukisikiza song yangu mwema kwa kora utasikia guardian tuko you know utasikia tu ai hapa gman ali ali alisaidia ude mkuna 1 2 3 alifanya when he decides to be a father you know he 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 does the role of a father and and he's he's a nice person and i will always thank him you know he he was used by god to bring me back he was used by god to show me that you know kuna watu huko nje pia that can love you so uh, asia and okay mimi for me personally hata before ni kwenda guardian mimi nafunjua vizuri 
kwanza napenda uimbaji wako mm. vocals zako nani kila kitu kwako na, mm. na, 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 natambua most of the time umekuja tumekutana kanisani mara nyingi mingi na nimeona eh, bidii yako na uimbaji mzuri na na worship mzuri mm. eh, na nilikuwa kwa event ya ya Cardian Angel mm. aki launch album, album yake yeah. and mimi personally nilikuwa pale Cardian Angel akasema eh, mtu yote akona talent mm. na anataka support mm. ya ingie tu kwa studio mm. alipe yako pale ku support kwa Africa kabisa yeah. for me na jo uko talent mm. tunaweza sema Cardian Angel kuna kitu amepongezea labda umeona mm. eh nilikuwa msaha lakini hapa Cardian Angel yeah, amesa, yeah. ameongeza yeah. kitu hebu yeah. tuambie uh, one thing Gadi na mepile a big role mm-hmm. kwa music ministry yangu. So many people didn't know about Asia. Mm-hmm. But through Guardian, watu wengi wanajua sasa kuna Asia. Mm-hmm. Through Guardian, you'll feel kuwa mwelekezo wake in how to, to do the, the songs. Mm-hmm. Ukisikiza song yangu ya before na hii ya after, uta feel there's a difference. Uta feel there's a difference. You, so I can say he has played a big role kwa music music ministry yangu and i'm learning a lot through him i'm also learning sasa kucheza music zangu live through yeye bado and ametupea platform well i can still say lipa studio and uh, utapata gadi ya nako no kimpata he will guide you mimi kama hii song yangu ya mwema nilikuwa nimeka a different verse gadi na kasiza tuki record akakuja toka tuambi ah hiyo verse na feel like complicated mm. we need something simple yeah. yenye hata mtu anaweza imba church kama present worship yeah. mtu anaweza imba kama worship mm. and that is when now alichukua the words zenye nilikuwa nimeandika Akam. na akanitungia a simple so, chorus, chorus yeah. akanemba the verses are very okay but no hii chorus it is very complicated mm. tunahitaji kitu simple yenye mtu anaweza kativi na imbe tu umekuwa mwema umekuwa mwema hapa nilipofika umekuwa rafiki bora it is very simple you know anybody can sing it hata kanisani unasema kama present worship nikiambia eshi yenye kwenu mbaji umesikia hebu tupigie tena umekuwa mwema umekuwa mwema hapa nilipofika umekuwa rafiki bora umekuwa mwema umekuwa mwema hapa nilipofika umekuwa rafiki bora wow eh hebu sasa tukimalizia mm-hmm. ambia tu watu wale ukejeri eh Cardian Angel na pia mashabiki wako wa English kwambie tu kitu about no. Cardian uh, I would say I would say for 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 guardian what when you wanna mkejeli huko nje when you meet this man utampenda bora and not just guardian angel even Esther Musila when you meet these two people and 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 you interact with them utawapenda bora they are one real people and 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 and, and, and there's a grace that is on guardian there is a grace that this man carries that unaweza itafuta hata mimi mwenyewe sije kama niko nayo unachogoda na kwanga ametupea different grace guardian kuna grace ako tu nayo ndani yake this man he's he's a worshiper naturally this man ukikana yeye hata tukiwa hapo studio sessions wote utamwona tu ameshika gita yake na you know hivyo tu namsikia tu ameanza kuimba kitu na sikia kusema eh na hiyo hiyo touch iko sawa and that is how he has made kanyimbo I save I say I need to fanya baadaye. Even even the next project that we have worked with him that maybe will come in between before the year ends. Nile tu cha feel Gadi na menda ameshika keyboard I feel eh hapo kachini kako sawa and I say me aya. Ebu ebu watu tujarije Asia Asia jitarije Mike Mike Tony tengeneza mic haya tuanze. And it is not you don't even feel ugumu ya kuwa na huyu mtu. Ni mtu anakuwa understand same with you know same, same with even Esther you know these people they are very real and and when you interact with them i always tell you when you interact with these people utawaelewa utawapenda bure utakuwa waona ukipita na smile unatinda what am i smiling about and 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 as i said earlier when i met the seven heaven media team i was going through depression that nobody knew what i was going through 
But when these people came in my life, me feel love. Not from the manager Tony, not from Gadia, not from Esther. I felt ni me pata familia. To, a, to some point, ukiangalia kwa blog za Guardian, kuna birthday tulifanyaka chalia na ito Deus Deere. Mm, Liyana. Tulifanyaka mm. Deus Deere. Yeah. Na haikuwa planned. It was just someone, my sister Alice Maga, and I feel blessed. Mm. Derek, coincidence, Derek hapa anakuja, anakuja studio. Coincidence, yo siku ni birthday ya Derek. Mm. So it happened, you know, as God had planned it. Yeah. And when I told, when I told that kina Guardian, ah, I have prepared some lunch in the house. They were like, okay, come me. So if you watch the, the blog, Vizuru, to notice, kuna pati nye tumefanya kwa nyumba ya Guardian, kuna pati nye tumefanya kwa nyumba ya Angu. So we are more of a family. And and these people, when, when they when they are there to support you, they will support you fully. Hawana ile hypocrisy. Noja kuna mtu mungine Eric ndakuja ni kwambi, ah Eric ndaku support. Lakini hayuko ready kujitolea kusupport. Ndaku support, ndaku support. Ndaku support, ndaku support, lakini ya kusupport. For instance, minda pen example, bado na iso miyangu muema. Hii moment is my single project. But when Guardian felt, uyu dem had delivery a hundred percent, doi ngoma ikue a hundred, alikuja kongeza sauti yake. Hii muema, it had been recorded the first time with another producer. But Guardian akaisikiza kasema apana, tutaridui ngoma, na Alexis. Tuka redo. Na siku mulipa tena tu mara ya hii. Alinembea tu wewe, nitakuita ukuja we redo this thing. Mtu mwingine mwenye kama hiyo celebrity na fame. Ya yeah, katema, ah, studio yungu na ingiza do. Yeah, yeah. Wewe tu angoma itembe, itembe, you know, iko ni bad quality. You know, as much as we doing gospel, quality is also important. Tutatua quality mbaya, then nianze kukomplain DJ ya wanichezi. Oh, hawafanyi. Kumbe ni quality ni metoa, hindi yeah. mbaya. Na pia kini pia quality mbaya, Seven Heaven na itaji market. Yeah. So here it's again gain for both of us. Yeah. And what I'd love to encourage, to encourage, what I'd love to encourage people outside there, when, when, when you trust and believe in God, me, I'm a living testimony. God has been providing. Mimi God has been providing. Na yote, na nini, na nini. Yani, what you when when life is going to shuka temi ya corona, Mimi God haka nye levi to a different level. Wow. Nika hamata mali vili kuwa naishi, mm. nikenda a different place. Yani God ali change life yangu for better. Yes. Na sayo, I'm not working here. I'm not working. Atu wa mungu, mungu wana shukulikia. Mungu wana nishugulikia mwenyewe tu sija. Yani, hakuna sikuwa shai ni, ni shai kosa. Mm. Na even the days na feel ni kumwisho, na shindu wa God, I need to pay something. And I don't have it. By the end of the day, he provides. By the end of the day, he provides. And what I would love to encourage somebody outside there is just serve God in truth and in faith. When you just serve God, the atilia kuake. Ingi na yote ataleta. Sienzi sama chini me enjoy pesa ya muziki si jayona na am you know. But God ame ileta indirectly. Si jaka cha show ama gig ati yenye na hundred thousand, two hundred, half a million. I've not gotten it. But God has been sending people, the ones, the ones they are called destiny connectors, you know, I'm, I don't know what to call them. Mtu anakuja tu kuna, kuna, kuna ambia mtu, like Juzi, let me give you a testimony. On Sunday, ni kenda radio maisha. I was supposed to, siko ni meji register, hizi venye neza ukote, zini takuwa mini, hizi venye, hizo, siko ni meji register, hizo zini takuwa zina ukota revenues on my behalf, the royalties. And when I was looking at it, it was around, I needed like between 15 to 20,000. To be fully yani, I have owned the copyright of everything, ya music, ya musita half shida na mtu So when I was talking with my elder cousin, when I'm US, I said, I'm going to make it to you, I'm going to make it to you, I'm going to my copyrights, these are boats. I said, I'm going to make it to you, 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 I'm going to make it to Ivo tu, haka nitesta, haka nambia sayi na lala, ni kiyanka, nda kutumie yu pesa. Wow. Haka nambia ni kiyanka, nda kutumie yu pesa. Ani kafikiria uya na nichocha. You know, because she's my elder cousin. Sisa nasema, ayu ya neza kwa na nichocha. When I was going to radio maisha, ni kwa kwa kado. Ni kwa na impesa, titi you have received. Haki, I almost cried. I almost cried and I was like, God, umekua ukinifanya majabu. Umeko kinifanyia majabu that siwezi elezea. Mm. Yani if I start to explain it, I cannot explain it. I cannot. My comeback in the music industry, I have not spent any shilling paying for myself, be it studio, be it video. 
but God ame nitumania watu and every time i release a project unasikia mtu anakuambia tell me when is your next project i want i want to be in support of it jana two of my friends told me we want to be in support na wajaokoka si watu wameokoka waliniambia tu walinipigania jeshia tunapenda kazi unafanya when is your next project i want to be part of it ivo tu mungu ana provide so when we serve god in truth and in faith he will never ashamed you things go in line he will never ashamed you at all at all wow and it is she and you kwa this story imekuwa mingi lakini tunashukuru ile tu kitu tunaweza penda tu kuambia watu let let us support kenyan music our let us support our own yani sisi sisi mkitusukuma pia tutasukuma wale wengine. Kadi anasaidia wasi kama kwa sababu yeye ako mahali na anahisi kuna mahali nafaa wako. Lakini tukitumia ile ile words za kukejeli wase za kutuambia mambo mabaya, za kutuambia mambo ya kutushusha chini, huwa tunakosa pia ilo morali na nguvu ya kufanya nini ya kudeliver the best. So ile kitu ningependa tu eh, kwangu kwa Yesha Njoki paka kwenu support ni sisi ili tupate ile nguvu ya kufanya nini imagine hatuna pesa hatuna kazi vizuri na pia tuna zile mamba ambazo zinatushusha chini sisi tukakufa jamani so let us support each other ili tuende mbele sisi zote na kwangu washe yuki ndapini mimi yako pale sia channel yako pale na pia muende kwa channel yake msupport mwanzo na ngoma kali hapa amefanya na card and angel na tunajua kila kitu kitakuwa sawa na na mwisho God bless you. Amen. Hivyo tu. God bless you. Na mambo mengi amesema nibarikiwe na leo tumefika pale. Good. Pia mimi subscribe, fanya kila kitu vizuri tumezoea. Twende mbele tukijengana. Thanks. Bye bye.